Severe rainfall left behind the most flooding Dooley Silvesky can remember in 22 years. I probably have enough hay for my barn for about another month. She now needs to find hay for her 15 horses this summer, and she isn't alone. It seems like um, since last year was kind of a bad hay year too, nobody at this time has any good hay. However, the rainfall isn't the only thing to blame. Sylvesky says it hasn't been hot enough for the ground to dry out. The alternatives include getting hay shipped from western Pennsylvania or an expensive diet change for the horses. So you can see it's really green and really rich and to have this brought here right now, it's about uh, $25 per bale. So um, that's pretty costly. Typical bales of hay cost anywhere from three to six dollars. This year, however, that could be up to nine dollars. Sylvesky says they've never dealt with rain like this for so long, and they will do what they have to do to make it through this season. In Canfield, Vince Kyle, WKBN 27 First News.